Gaming, you know, I, I started when I was a kid because it captured my imagination. I've, I've particularly enjoyed games where I can, you know, explore some of the historical things that I have focused on in my classes. It, it keeps me connected creatively. I'm going to hear it better and respond better. Absolutely, Chris. Uh, I like the uh, tactical challenge of it. You have to think really carefully about gaming. You're both tactical and strategic. And I find that that's the same exact thing you do in a classroom. I teach a Game of Thrones class. I'm preparing a Hamilton course on Hamilton the Musical. It's always good to connect with students and to recognize that I can use stuff that is current and popular and of their interest. I love Game of Thrones because of the politics of it, and it's a really handy way for us to get into talking about, you know, the way the dictatorships work or authoritarian regimes work. When you're, when you're teaching um, college students especially, you can't just go in and bowl students over with, like, this is what we're covering. So you have to have your strategy. You have to know what you're gonna teach about. That's the best part of teaching it is my students learn from each other because Pitt has such a focus on that collaborative classroom.